I was watching American Idol last night, Ben Lieber. I know you haven't been watching any of it. No. But it really is. Because I, 26 seasons in, and I'm super into this. It's very fun. Last well, your night, kids love it, though. My kids like it, too. Last night, we finally fish, finished auditions. Next week, the contestants are heading to Hollywood, where they await the largest cut in Idol history. Oh, boy. So, producer Lauren Andrego is here. She's going to show us some of last night's highlights. Lauren. I was the producer who didn't know who Elon, uh, oh, yeah. Elon Eli Manning It's not was. Elon, it's Eli. It's Eli. Yeah, it gets, gets worse. worse. And a couple things in my defense. One, the photo was taken completely out of context. Okay. I had no It context. really was, yes. I didn't send you anything and I didn't, I, I again. saw Ben with his buddy on vacation <laughs> in a folder full of photos. Second, if it was Peyton, I think I would have. Oh, cute yes. dog! But you, in, in your defense, though, when I said his name, you're like, oh yes, well, yeah, I, I absolutely I do Elon, recognize Eli him. Eli Manning is. I thought I keep calling him Eli. I thought the uh, mustache kind of threw me. It off didn't really look like him, yeah. to be yeah. honest. Yeah. Yeah. It was vacation Eli, but either way, welcome back. Yeah. You thanks. missed a crazy idol. Last it was night. a good idol. It was. Yeah, I watched it with Bernie. We were baking banana bread and then watching the show. Aww. The boys are kind of in and out. But okay, let's uh, let's talk about some of your highlights. Yeah. So I saw two people last night that I think could win it. All. Ooh. And here's what we're going to do, Ben. I'm going to run some silent video, tell you about the person, and based on vibes alone, okay, vibe you're going to tell me which artist you think they auditioned with, okay? Okay, sounds so good. So let's start with Jaina. She's a 22-year-old from Washington, D.C. Last year, she was eliminated during Hollywood week, but she came back to redeem herself. Uh, super cute. Lionel called her a superstar. So based off her vibes, do you think she auditioned with Beyonce, Adele, Miley Cyrus, or Olivia Rodrigo? Mm. Uh, I'll go with Beyonce. Beyonce? Oh. Let's take a look. Just keep pushing It's always gonna be another mountain. I'm always gonna want to make it move. There's always gonna be an uphill battle. Sometimes I'm gonna... That's a Miley Cyrus song. That is, and a deep that's cut a deep from cut. Miley Cyrus. To even know that, I didn't even know I that didn't. was a Miley Cyrus oh, song. Oh, really? Well, she had a different take on it, but that's from the Hannah Montana movie, The Climb. Oh, well, that explains yeah. it. Yeah, I'm too old for the Hannah. But Montana But that was like era. one of Miley Cyrus's first big hits. But I, th I loved this arrangement so of it. Good. I thought she was so cool. Yeah. Um, and, and a real big transition from last year to this year, showing yeah. some of the clips of it. Yeah. Oh man. Lauren, I'm so glad you got me on board. She nailed this. Okay, next up, Bethany. Let, Bethany, another one that I, as soon as I heard her, like I, she took my breath away. She's 25 years old from Charlotte, North Carolina. She brought a huge family with her to the audition, and she told the story about being adopted by her grandmother when she was five years old, mm. um, and how her childhood was a little bit different from typical. But based on vibes alone, which former Idol superstar do you think she sang a song from? Kelly Clarkson, Jennifer Hudson, Carrie Underwood. Jordan Sparks. Ooh, more superstars. It seems like she's hitting a lot of like big notes. Uh, I'm gonna go Jordan Sparks. Ooh, let's take a look. Six years old, and you know, he never walks away. He never asks for money. He takes care of me. He loves me. Peace by peace. He restored my faith that I may could be kind. And a father could stay. All right, Kelly for two. But that's okay. okay, I'm over two, you guys. Stop <laughs> keeping score. It's a Kelly okay. Clarkson song. And that's Kelly a really Clarkson's emotional, song. emotional Kelly Clarkson oh song. Oh my gosh. Kelly Clarkson actually debuted on American Idol a couple years ago, if oh. you remember that. That was the first place. And she was in tears when she sang it. Everybody was in tears when she sang it. And now but... she's changed the lyrics to that song. Yeah, like that's taking that song back. Taken a bit of a turn. Yeah. Um, yeah. Either she's way. She's got a great voice. Oh, yeah. Someone I think we definitely need to watch yes. in the next couple of weeks. Speaking of which, here was my favorite audition of the night. I think it was your favorite audition of the night. Agreed, too. agreed. Yeah. Her name's Julia Gagnon. She was the last person to perform. Um, and she also shared her adoption story. Her adoptive father, who they, they adopted her from Guatemala when she was very little. Um, and when she was a teenager, she expressed the desire to meet her mom, to mm -hmm. find her mom. So her dad hired a private investigator to find her mom in Guatemala. They figured out who she is. She hasn't met her yet. Um, I was thinking Idol was going to like, oh, yeah, her yeah. Out. I feel like yeah, it's going to be coming. Thing. That That's could be, be coming. coming. Uh, but yeah, she, she blew us all away with a 1960s Queens anthem. Choose from one of these, Ben. Diana Ross, Aretha Franklin, Janis Joplin, Cher. Oh, I'm going to go Janis Joplin. Ooh, okay. let's take a look. Someone you're not me to me the side, the side that you do. Oh, baby, 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 don't you know? 
Okay, so I'm over three. You're over. Yeah, right, sorry, right. not, not good at this game. Sorry. That is, that could be the hardest song ever sung on American Idol. Like no one would pick that song. You have to be able to do it as well as Aretha Franklin, I think, if you want to sing that in front of people. She the has an unbelievable voice. Those judges could not even control themselves. I would say she is the next Adele. Like yes, that is how be. good really? she is. Really? That big? Uh, Unbelievably we only good. Heard, yeah, only heard her sing one song, but um, yeah, I'm excited to see what she does next. And, and what like what's her specialty? Is she going to keep bringing these classics out, or is she going to do yeah. something contemporary? Okay, Ben, one more question for you. Mm -hmm. Which of those three earned the platinum ticket? Of those three contestants? Well, then the, la the last one, yeah, then, for right. sure. You got it. Yeah. it you got one right. Yeah. I got one right, yeah, if that you got counts. It. So, so Hollywood's next week. It's going to be one of the biggest cuts in Idol history, and three platinum ticket winners will get some sort of advantage. We don't know what that is yet, but as you'll remember in the last couple of years, yeah. those platinum ticket winners were kind of the MVPs. Right. Um, and they got to, like, skip the first round of, uh, of Hollywood week. So yeah, they get a bye week. See what happens. And it's yeah. Sunday and Monday next week, right? Yep, Sunday and Monday, and then it's going to move to Monday. So that's a good note to remember as we head into April. Okay, okay. Important. Important. And yeah. this is a time to get on board if you're not on board. Watch. And it's go, really fun. Go on YouTube. You can watch all the auditions that you've missed so far and, and remember who, who your favorites are. Of course, we're voting for former Minnesota Viking Blake. Yeah. Um, Blake and, Kroll. And yeah, a lot of superstars to watch. Thanks, this year. Lauren. Thank you. I mean, thank you. How about that? American Idol 954 just keeps getting better and <laughs> no, better. No, it really does. All right, you can catch American Idol uh, this Sunday at 7. And remember, it moves to Monday after this next week. Is that correct? Sundays and Monday. Sunday and Monday, then, and then Monday, Monday permanently after that. Uh, you can find it right here on 5 Eyewitness News. And our American Idol recaps are sponsored by Woodhouse Spa. You can indulge in a relaxing spa experience that will melt your worries away, leave you feeling transformed and rejuvenated. So call now or visit woodhousespas.com. You can book a massage, a facial, or a body treatment. So they have locations in Maple Grove, Woodbury, and we're pumped about the Rosedale Center one. Coming soon, guys.